YouTube, it is Bulbasaur Trainer here, giving you a deck profile for um, Hammerhead. It's kind of a deck me and my friends made together. It's a game of Pokemon, so I just want to get right in it. So, run three, let me get you a better view of those. Three Landers EX. Now, he is one of the main components of his deck, the deck, because of his uh, focus. Because of his ability, Hammerhead, I don't think you can read that. But what it does is it does 30 to active and 30 to one of the bench. So, it's a good turn one play because it only costs one fighting energy. This is a very good Pokemon altogether. 180 HP. I mean, weak to water, so kind of weak against the Caldeo decks. Next, I run three Mewtwo's. The reason I run three Mewtwo's is because it's a really good card altogether. I mean, double color, this is in here, is in there somewhere. This is a really good card. It can uh, kill anything. I mean, it can kill another Mewtwo because of the weakness of it and it's psychic. Altogether a good card, 170 HP right there, as you can see. It's a really good card, X-Ball, double colorless. It's a really good card. Another main part of Hammerhead, really, is a Terrakion. The reverse one on the side. Um, see, I have some EXPs and shares in there. So what you do is you put it on Terrakion. His one ability is colorless and fighting. You place one on there, you active dies, you get out here, you do 90. So other ability is... Land Crush, which costs three energies. And uh, see, two fighting, one colorless doesn't die new, which isn't that bad either. Two Emolgas. Basically, because everything in this deck's a basic, so I can help get out any really basics I need at the moment. Four Pokemon catchers, that's just uh, basic staples. Everyone should run four catchers, maybe three. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm keeping my voice down. It's just kind of late at night, and uh, family's sleeping. I couldn't find a better time to do this. And if you couldn't tell, this is my first YouTube video for Switch, and now the reason I run for Switch. So as you can see, right, I don't know if you can see three retreat cost. So it's the same guy. Hmm. Two retreat cost. Four retreat cost. The only thing I have that has a lower creep cost is, um, Molga, which is free. Four heavy balls, as you can tell, obvious reasons. My main dudes have a retreat cost of three or more, so I run this bad boy. Three EXP shares. This is another main part of the deck. So basically, I can get these onto my bench Terrakion. So then when my Landers dies, which should probably be my active at the time, it gives the energy off to Terrakion. So they'll come out and retaliate for 90 to a lot of damage. Maybe die to a Kildeo, but I'll have another one on the bench. Two Eviolite, good good card in here because it reduces the 20 damage your dudes will take. And everything in here is a basic, so it won't, it won't like ever be bad, really. Two Rocky Helmets, pretty good card. I don't see why people think it's bad. It's a tool, does 20 damage. It's just really good. It doesn't have to be a basic. Two Tool Scrappers, that's just for, um, for if I come against, like, a mirror match or against, um, friend who plays Garbodor. It's really good. Computer search, obvious reasons everyone should run that. No, I don't think people will agree in here, but I personally like to run four ends. I don't see Colorus as being a better card in here. I know it'll be a good card, but I like four ends to mess up my opponent and also just to have a good card game. Like, if they have one prize card, I can end and give them one if I'm behind. Or Juniper is Juni Juniper is just a great trainer. I mean, discard your hand, draw seven. I mean, that's never bad. A bad hand. These guys are always gonna be good. I only run two Skylas because I'm not really trainer heavy. I have my four heavy balls to search for them. But I don't. I personally don't like Skylas as a trainer. I think she's good. She's won me games before. One Sharon, one Bianca. Just because Sharon's okay, you can draw me three when ring. Four junipers, so I don't really need that. Bianca's just okay. I mean, drop to six. I, that can be pretty good at some points. Three double colorless. Three double colorless. I move for moving over there. You just saw my cat. I, I, I run three. I don't want four because I already have some energy problems on this deck. Three, obviously, for Mewtwo and even uh, Terrakion and Landers can use them. Like, I don't know why I keep moving to the side. Then I run, gosh, I think it's like... Six, eight, ten, eleven fighting energies because these are, you know, the main part. I don't use any other color. 
Well, yeah, thanks for watching. That's my deck profile. I like what I like to call MC Hammerhead with a touch of Mewtwo.